This is an N channel MOSFET 30N06L and in this video I'm going to show you how to use it with an Arduino and how to switch on and off a 12V motor with it. The 30N06L is a logic level enchantment type N channel MOSFET. Logic level means that 5V is enough to switch it on and off. Enchantment type means that it is normally off. It is easy to wire it up to be off by default by just adding a pull down resistor from the gate terminal to the source. An N channel MOSFET activates when you apply positive voltage to the gate compared to the source. To achieve this with an Arduino, you have to connect the ground pin to the source terminal of the MOSFET. Now you can turn the MOSFET on and off from a digital output pin. You need a power source for the 12V motor. I have this adjustable power supply. And I'm going to use the USB cable from my PC to power my Arduino. First, let's start with connecting the motor to the power supply. The MOSFET will act as a switch to turn the motor on and off. Add a 10K pull-down resistor between the gate and the source terminal of the MOSFET. This will ensure that the motor stays off while there is no active signal on the gate. Otherwise, it can be floating in a half-active state. Now connect the negative output of the power supply to the source terminal of the MOSFET and the drain terminal to one of the leads of the motor. Then connect the positive output of the power supply to the other end of the motor. We also need a flyback diode since a motor is an inductive load. When the MOSFET gets switched off, the coils inside the motor will continue pushing the current forward and that will create a huge voltage spike on the MOSFET. A flyback diode lets the induced current flow back to the motor until all the excess energy is dissipated. And now we can test the circuit before connecting the Arduino. Currently, the MOSFET is in the off state since the gate is pulled down to the source by the 10K resistor. If we connect the gate to the positive side of the power source, then the MOSFET will start conducting and the motor starts to run. Connect the Arduino ground pin to the source terminal of the MOSFET. And finally, connect the digital output pin to the gate terminal. In the Arduino code, we need to define the I.O. pin as an output. Then set it to low to turn the motor off and uh, set it to high to turn it on. This code will turn the motor on and off after every second. If you use the PWM pin for the digital output, then you can use the analog write command to run the motor at half the power. You can subscribe to the channel to see more tutorials like this. Thank you for watching.